Welcome, thank them for coming out. And uh, what we're going to do is we're going to start with some photos over here. And we'll get everybody through so we get your photo first. And then after that, we can, Daryl can come around and visit you. And do you have any leaf questions or flyers? Whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Detroit, Detroit. <laughs> Daryl Ballard, we'll go there. Yeah, oh my goodness. Um, so yeah, we're just gonna we'll just do the photos first, and then if you had uh, any uh, items that uh, you were gonna get autographed and get tickets for that, just have them out for when he comes to your table, and then perhaps in between periods we can do a little Q and A. So the team flies into the Moncton Airport that we didn't have charter planes. And these kids had all played hooky from school, right? And uh, they're all getting the autographs. We're waiting for our bags. I remember I was a 20 year old kid watching all this, and we're staying excited. So I grab my bag and I walk out to the team bus, and I'm standing there, and uh, with another rookie, Bob Liddy, the Saskatchewan kid. We're standing there waiting and whatever, and I see these two little kids and they're looking at us like this and they've got this piece of the book. Sir, can we have your autographs, right? So Liddington signed it, I signed it, and I had it back to them, and I'm watching it to them all, trying to, oh, they're just a couple more boys. Oh, <laughs> 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 uh, I've got a little bugger who's got it today. <laughs> 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 I kind of flip out, oh, like, hey, guys, get off that thing, right? They kind of look at me like I'm the grumpy old guy, right? I said, listen, this, this isn't a playground. They have a little respect for it. This is traditional. They don't want it. It's not <laughs> <laughs> So now I'm taking a picture with my grandson. The little kids, the other kids sit over there with kind of a long face on. A bus pulls up with all tourists and hockey fans. They all come and now they swarm around the statue. Now the kid realizes that I'm the guy that told him. <laughs> so then one other time, about two years later, I have a place in Florida in the middle of winter. I get a email or text from one of the guys in the office. He said, Daryl, he checked this out. He said, on the way in this morning, we had to do a little detail work on your statue, right? And uh, what had happened, the night before, they had one of those rock, heavy band concerts, you know, all that heavy, loud music. I guess on the way home, guys stuck a doobie in them all the way. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, no respect, right? <laughs> See you at the Stanley Cup yeah. parade, eh? Yeah. In Vancouver. In Vancouver. Yeah.